and we can head up here. Everything around here looks like fried shrimp to me. Primarily this. This looks like the tail. Uh, but for the time being, uh, we're, we're just going to head forward here. Mm, now I'm hungry. Shouldn't have pointed that out. I bet I made one of you hungry too. Sorry for that. Let's just keep going forward. There's a record of fate here, but I don't really care too much. We can save on the world map. Um, oh, speaking of which, I haven't really pointed out uh, how to change party members. As of right now, you can't. Um, because of some of the decisions that I made. But we can find an Electro Jolt in there. Uh, if you had made other decisions, you could have a, the opportunity to switch party members at this point. But uh, I don't. Maybe later. Well, of course later. Hey, 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 you gotta be crazy to walk around this forest without protective gear. I have an extra set with me. Take them. This way you'll be able to walk through the marsh without getting hurt. And we get the safety gear. Now we can walk through the marsh without getting hurt, just like he said. Oh, and watch out for the monsters lurking deep within the forest. We haven't actually explored those parts yet. We don't know how to get there. Honestly, I don't right now either. Well, at least I don't have the ability to do it, but we'll get there, we'll get there. If you wanna go deeper into the forest, you need the proper equipment and the means to control those strange plants. Indeed, I do need the means to control those strange plants. And so far, walking up to him and pressing the button seems to do the trick, but maybe it won't do it deeper on. And they're giving you all the tips you need right here. But we are ready to move forward. And uh, actually, well, by forward, I mean back. We're going to go back to pretty much where we were. I so wish that healed me like other games, but it does not. So we're going to have to get into another fight so that I can heal sense. That is kind of the downside of it, that um, like I can't use the element literally outside a battle. I can only use it after a battle. Uh, so now we can run around without getting hurt, thanks to the safety gear. Apparently he had three for those. Even when that fit mojo with that nail. <laughs> but over here we can get some tablets. And we can head north. I don't believe there's a point to going east just yet. But up here, we can find another new enemy, and today, yeah, there we go. I don't think that necessarily gets me where I want to go, though, unfortunately. Yeah, this place can go up and down so many things. Uh, let's just take this guy on. You do have to press the button on the potpourri. I'm hoping that we can show off the other guy that's around here. Plus, I do want to get a heal after this. I think I heard him, so. Yeah, there he is! Swamp Bug. I always hear like a, a paw or something when he shows up. All right, let's take on the potpourri first, though. Actually, it'd probably be better if I took on the arena. So let's uh, let's switch over to Lena. Lena is not going to do very much damage to the swamp bug at all because they're the same in its color. And, okay. All right, one, two, three. Switch to Mojo. Hit the swamp bug. It's like a swarm, but it's in the swamp, so it's a swamp. Seriously, Mojo! Damn it, Mojo. Uh, as was pointed out, the accuracy that is shown here is only your chance to hit before you factor in enemy evasion. But uh, still, you know, you see the number, and that's what you assume it's going to be. And that's not always the case. So like I said, one, two, three, switch. Uh, that way you can save the most powerful attacks uh, for later. It works a lot better when you have three party members, which is why I kind of saved this tactic for that. All right, Mojo, come in and finish off the Swamp Bug. I should do it. Oh, suck, Mojo. You and your damn high agility and nothing coming from it. All right, down he goes. Switch back over to Potpourri, see what we can do. We can miss. It's static. It doesn't move. Yet you missed. Yeah, go ahead and smack it good. Just smack it with the spoon. It, I would normally say that Lena has the weird attacks, but, you know, we've seen Mojo now. Really? Yeah, front kick, pirouette, and spin for the attack. All right, go, Lena. You're up next, I guess. Actually, I should just bring in Surge in here. All right, and then switch over to Surge. Close to death. 
finish it off here. There you go. Down it goes. Well, we do get poisoned as well. We'll have to heal that. This time on Lena. I would not recommend going back to town to heal. Uh, it costs you 100 G, 100 gold to heal with the freaking Komodo pup. More HP for people. Nothing too exciting there. All right, use consumables. They're still refusing to use it. All right, we get another arrow saucer and carapace this time. Carapace is nice. And we're still poisoned, so let's go ahead and peel that, because that's actually pretty bad. It works pretty quickly when you don't have that much HP. All right, we'll head up here. Ooh. He, he doesn't, he doesn't want to deal with me. Are you a rightum, surgeon? The toxin levels seem higher here than at the entrance. The plants must have mutated. Did that actually hurt me? It did. That guy's a dick. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? See now, I know there's some. Oh, duh. Down here. Almost missed it. And here we can find a bushwhacker, which is what I was looking for in the first place. Odd to find them one at a time. Usually they come in pairs, and if you get that, then you're old, just like me. A long time ago, the, bush the bushwhackers were popular. All right. We are done here. Uh, we can try to explore over here, but uh, as you can see. No, yeah, that, just like I thought, the surface of the slope is too slippery to climb. Yeah, we can't get it. They just tease you with it for the time being. So I think we are done here. Um, do I want to get into a fight? Yeah, I'll, I'll take this guy. And it looks like I got the good level up. Out, or good stat gain out of this fight. So everybody got one point in three different things. No HP though, which is kind of weird. All right, Max without, because it doesn't really matter. Heal and cure, 381 G coming my way. Maybe 100 G isn't too bad, but it still sounds so expensive to me. Still got poison though. That always seems to happen. This time it was lean. Still have seven of those though, so we are good to go. We are done in the Hydra Marshes, mostly because there's nothing more that I can do. Uh, so we'll have to find something else to do. How about what they told us to do? That actually sounds like a good plan. So back to Fossil Valley South. Even though we weren't specifically told to come here, we did hear the word uh, Termina quite a bit, and this is the way to go there. Our excavation is nearly complete. Just stick to the low path and make your way through. We still have some of our men working on the high ground, so do not interfere with their work. Wow, looks like they're letting us through for once. You have anything to say? Our excavation, oh, you're just gonna say the same thing? Oh, come on. Like everybody else has something unique to say in this game, except for you. All right, so. Nothing to do over here. Let's investigate what the hell this is. Turns out it's a monster. We're up against dingoes. We have Bubba dingoes and Mama dingoes. They're all red, so uh, we know we'll be good against them. But uh, Serge will probably end up doing more damage because of his power level. Uh, you know what? Yeah, two, two, and then down goes one of the babies. <laughs> Beat up those dingoes! Anger! Strengthen. Maybe I should uh, go for you first then. We'll see. No, they bit my mojo! Uh, let's go for Lena. Lena, go ahead and take out the mama dingo if you would. Or you could miss a lot. That, that's great too. That's just great. Yeah, we'll go with Surge next. And then a big attack. Oh, come on. Oh, I thought I had it. All right, Mojo, take out the Mama Dingo. There we go, over to Lena. Lena, finish the job here. Come on. There we go, down goes the Mama. Now we're just left with the one of the babies. Do I feel bad about this? Not as much as you would think. Let's just go straight to Surge. So we can get a good attack in. 
There we go. Yeah, this is uh, this is a game where you actually do have to use a little bit of strategy in the fighting. Uh, so there is a bit of a learning curve to it. And I I'm trying to, to show off the learning curve a little bit as we go. So since we already got the good level up, uh, nobody's going to get it anymore, despite whatever my paper guide says. And once again, one side online. But the, the wiki says that it stops at that point. So there you go. Leather and fur. I trust the wiki more than I trust, I think it's Brady guides? Whatever. Either way, uh, we were told to stick to the low road, so let's try to go for the high road. What happens if I go up here? We are investigating a supernatural phenomenon up there. It's off limits to the, hey, are you the exorcist we sent for? How did you know? I totally am an exorcist. Oh, great. I thought you'd be a little older. Well, exorcism is really a young man's game these days. Please make your way up the rope ladder. You know, uh, the old men, they have trouble fighting the demons. It really requires swordplay these days, more than you would think. Whoa. You guys hear that? Sounds like a howl. Are you the exorcist? You're younger than I expected. I look young for my age. Anyway, do you hear that howling sound from down yonder? I do. All we want you to do is to stop that noise. We don't believe in ghosts. But go do what you have to do. But do you believe in demons is the good question. They say there is a ghost in Arnie Village and now this mysterious howling. Why must we conduct such strange investigations? A ghost in Arnie Village? Nobody mentioned that there. I hope it's not some kind of omen. The omen? It's Damien. How you doing? No one's been down there yet. There might be a monster that'll bite your head off. Why am I in charge here? It's only my first day on the job. Like, your job here, or your job in general? What the hell? Nyah, nyah, nyah. <laughs> Looks like I'm causing quite a stir. I've been waiting forever for someone like you. Yeah, I know. You and I are both dead, eh? I don't know how I ended up like this. I don't have a body and I don't remember a thing. You understand what I'm going through, don't you? But I have a feeling everything will come back to me once I find my body parts. So how about it? Will you help me find my body? Indeed I will. Yuck, yuck, yuck. <laughs> yeah? I'm heavier than I look, but I hope you don't mind. And don't swing me around too much. I start feeling nauseous. Surge received a heavy skull. And we've stopped the howling. Best exorcists ever. Oh, they were running around right there. I wanted to talk to that guy. I did it. Skulls are not supposed to jump around. Have you ever met Murray? You must have used some kind of supernatural trick. Anyway, we'll take care of the rest, so please be on your way. Just send your invoice to Viper Manor. Thank you. Viper Manor? Why does that sound familiar? From two different things, maybe. I'm glad that was taken care of. I wonder how Sir Karsh is doing. You know, with the Isle of the Damned incidents and all. What? Uh, it's nothing. I didn't say anything. Can I talk to this guy? Is there anywhere I can get over to him? Maybe if I go that way. You don't have anything new to say. Not a damn thing new. Can I? I can't go over to him. Did this thing move? It did. Because it's a monster! 